I, I originally had no intention of necessarily putting up a video about the Nordstrom anniversary sale this year. I have done it for the last, I don't know, six years, it seems, um, or so and enjoyed every minute of it. However, I know that people have been kind of on the fence about it, you know, how to feel about it and so forth. However, I did get so many emails, so many requests asking if I was going to show my favorites or whatever. So I decided what I would do is I would show you what I ordered personally. And I got some things for the house, some things for my husband and some things for myself. A couple of the items I have on here I saw are items that I love and I already have, so I didn't order them again, but they're on here because I already know I love them. And if you don't already have them, I recommend them. So if you're interested in seeing what I got um, for myself and husband and house and so forth and the things that I love, stay with me. Let's take a look. I am at my desk right now and I have the things up on my computer. So I'm going to be looking back and forth. Anyway, there's a kind of in sort of an order, but not so much. And I'll try to just get through them as quickly as I can with pictures <clears throat> right here. Okay. This item I have always wanted. I thought this, this to me, this is just a classic. It's the barber quilted jacket. I'm getting it in black. Um, I love quilted jackets. They're just as kind of perfect medium weight. If you're wearing a warmer sweater underneath, you can go in even colder temperatures. Um, but if you just have a blouse on underneath, it's just kind of the perfect extra layer. Um, even though I am moving to a very hot climate, I will be obviously going back and forth and visiting my dad and so forth. So I still will go into, um, you know, wintry places. So this is something that fabulous price on sale, great quality, good classic, love it. So there's that. Um, and for these two items, I'm getting the um, Barefoot Dreams in the Wild Throw Blanket in this co color way. They have many different color choices. I just think that looks different. I really like the kind of animal sort of bit to it. So I really do like that. And um, I'm also getting one in a solid color in this color blue. I have it in the cream, I think, is it ivory or cream color? I don't know which one they call it. But anyway, I love that thing. And I'm always running up to my office to grab it, to bring it down to the family room or whatever. Or when my grand dog, Gracie, comes over, she will go wherever that blanket is and she will commandeer it as her own and she doesn't want to ever leave it. So she loves it too. <laughs> so I thought, you know what, for the price, being lower like this, I can see myself using the heck out of those. So I got those. Um, again, lots of different colors and even another style too that has kind of a floral, which I really debated on. Really cute. So take a look at those also. Um, this red dress. I like this brand. They always just fit me. Um, you know, it's a simple type of a thing. I like the fact that it's a dark red. I don't own a red dress. Um, but I've always kind of wanted to have one that was ladylike, I guess. Um, nothing that looked like a holiday party. Um, so I'm going to give this one a try. I think it's just sort of a perfect style and I love that dark red color. So we'll see how that goes for me, but I think it's going to be nice. I really, I really think I'm going to like it. I'm excited about that one. This floral blouse. I just think it's so cute. I'm not hugely into ruffles, but I've definitely ruffled it up a little bit more this year than usual because of all the styles and the ruffles and things, but I liked this print. I just thought that would be very, very cute with either just blue jeans or white pants or white jeans or skirt, whatever. I just think it would be so pretty. You can add any other color too, because there's lots of colors in there. So I really like that. Also got that. Um, the convertible strapless bra. I talked about this in my favorites video. Uh, might've been the last one I did. Um, love this bra. And I mentioned then that it would be on sale or in the Nordstrom sale. So here it is for those of you who might want to try this one. I like the convertible straps and it is a comfortable bra that stays up. You don't feel like you need to tug on it constantly. So there's that one. Uh, wit and wisdom jeans. I love wit and wisdom jeans. Those are always very good. And this is a pair that I know I will wear like crazy all, you know, all the time. So got these in a size that works for me better now. Um, these sandals, I'm going to give them a try. I think they're adorable. They're by Draper and is it Draper James? I think it's the um, Reese Witherspoon line. I liked the fact that they just basically blended in with the foot, but they had the floral uh, detail on there. I thought that was just added a little something special and I thought it was just too cute not to try. They also have it in this kind of a, I think they call it red, but it looks more of a fuchsia to me, like a muted fuchsia and, um, in an orangey type of a tone also. So I got the, uh, the beige tannish, whatever, whatever color. This straw Panama hat. Um, I like the fact that it has the 
strap thing. Um, if I'm on a boat or whatever, I don't have to worry about it flying off. Um, in a convertible, that kind of thing, I'm all the time worried about my hat flying off. So I think this would be handy. I really like the general, again, classic look of it. Can go with anything. And I'm always trying to cover my face, you know, so I don't get the world's hugest amount of freckles. And I do think that also helps cut down on, um, you know, wrinkles and so forth. So I'm always wearing a hat. So this one is going to be my next favorite. I'm just sure of it. They came out with another beauty exclusive um, hourglass palette, the ambient lighting palette. And I debated, I'm like, how many of these do I need, right? I still use all the time the ones I have. The, the product lasts forever. I, it really does. Um, but it came with the very first tone and there is the dim. I love that one. That is my favorite all over uh, face powder. It just gives you this kind of an airbrush look. Love that. And then the, um, the blush tone in there looks like something would be great for summer. So I'm going to try that. I don't have that one already. And then the bronzer, it's for, it's the light, uh, bronze look thing. So I like that because it's a good color for me also. So that will be coming to me too. These things are set to arrive any minute now. This Oribe set. The Oribe Dry Texturizing Spray, all time, hands down, favorite texturizing spray I've ever used. I absolutely adore it. And it's almost, I think it's like $50, $49 by itself. Um, and this also comes with the dry shampoo by Oribe and everything by Oribe is just so, so good. So this is a win-win if you want to try their dry shampoo or if you already know and love it and you know you want to try their um, dry texturizing spray. So good. So this set is a good deal. Um, this translucent SPF powder, that's another thing I'm always having with me. I always throw one in my bag. I have one of those sort of like a mineral, can, you know, it's the mineral sunscreen in a powder form. It's translucent. You can put it right on over your makeup. It doesn't mess with your makeup look at all. It just tends to uh, give you another layer of SPF if you want to reapply during the day or whatever. I love having it. I'll put it on the back of my hands if, you know, if I'm out and about a lot so I don't get a lot of sun there too. Wherever, chest, whatever, it works. You can just slap it on anything and you're a little bit more protected. So I really like that. Um, this Kiehl's um, hand salve. Oh boy. Especially if you're gardening or if you're washing things a lot and your hands really, really, really need the help. Um, when I'm feeling especially dry and just kind of overdone with my hands, this is the most miracle stuff in the world. It feels so good to just like slide that stuff on and just let it soak in and your hands feel like new hands. So whenever that's on sale, I always grab another bottle of that. Um, if you don't already have this T3 curling iron, I do highly recommend it. I absolutely love mine. I have mine in the, um, it's like more of a gray tone or maybe mine's blue, I don't know. But anyway, it's the same one with the 1.25 inch barrel. Perfect for just sort of, you know, big waves. Love it, simple, one pass. Good, good to go. Great price for that. Uh, the Bumble and Bumble Invisible Oil Set. I love the, the spray one uh, in this, and I'm going to make sure I give the others a good try on that, but I wanted to grab another of the spray. I love it. It's a primer. Um, I, can, I spray it on when my hair is just sort of wet, uh, towel dried from the shower, and then just, you know, it's heat protectant, and it just really helps everything do well. Now, my very favorite thing though is after, let's, yeah, I don't know, every once in a while, I'll just feel like everything's getting dry. You know what I mean? And no matter how much I condition, because I use conditioner every time I wash, which I don't wash my hair every day, but it just sort of feels like it gets dry, especially on the ends. And many times before I go to bed at night, I'll just spray some of that in and I'll just kind of work it through with my hands. And it just, it doesn't look greasy or oily or anything like that. Even like just, I mean, just going to bed, so it wouldn't matter if it did, but it just takes this, it just takes it up a notch in moisture for sure. And then the next morning I'm jumping in the shower and I use it again as the protectant and whatnot. But it just really adds extra um, moisture to my hair without it weighing it down and whatever. So I really like that and I'm excited to try those other bits. So it's neat that it comes in the set. This is really cool. It's a hair and scalp mist that has SPF. So my hubby is getting a little sparse up top and you know, it just, it happens, it's okay. Um, I feel like I am too sometimes getting a little sparse up top. So it is what it is, right? When you're out in the sun and he hates to wear hats. Oh, he just hates it. So he just feels like he's just so hot and confined with a hat on. And we're always trying to spray sunscreen on his head. A lot of sunscreens that are for your body don't really work well with hair, but this stuff really does. So you can spray it in your, you know, your part or wherever you feel like you need to add some sunscreen if you have a bald spot, whatever it is. 
uh, you can spray it in there. It works beautiful with your hair. It doesn't mess anything up there and you are protected from getting a sunburn. And have you ever had that where you've been on the beach or something and you get a sunburn right like where the part of your hair is? It's not fun. So <laughs> this is a really cool idea and I like it. Sigma brushes are so good. I love Sigma brushes and this set, it's a, it's a new thing. Um, I don't believe I've ever seen this set before and I believe it says new on the, the thing. Um, these are four brushes I have and I love and they work for so many things. Um, the, the two smaller ones are great for packing on eyeshadow and then blending out like, you know, around you know, fluffier bit there. And the larger one is perfect for um, like blush and things like that and, uh, you know, any kind of a contour, not contour, um, bronzing, whatever. And then that smaller one really is much smaller in the fact that it can easily get like, if you want to do some sculpting a little bit with some um, contouring or whatever. So good. They're always so well made. Love them. So I think that's a great idea. This beach towel, guys, I just thought it was beautiful. I think it is adorable. And I never like my beach towels to match. Like whenever we have different beach, I like different different ones. So everybody knows which one is theirs and you know, you get to choose, okay, that one's mine. So then if they're in a pile, you know, which one to grab, whatever. Um, so anyway, I just thought this was so pretty and vibrant and gorgeous. So I grabbed it. Um, and it's going to be mine. <laughs> then for my husband, I grabbed for him a few shirts. He can always use, especially in the summer, he can always use short sleeve, um, just like button down collared, uh, tops shirts that uh, he wears constantly, all this type of thing, anytime we go out to eat, whatever. And so I got this tropical one for him. I think it'll work really nicely in Florida. Plus he has uh, several other, you know, Hawaiian-y type looking shirts. And I thought this one was nice. Um, and then I got him this color of this next one. It's called Swedish Blue. I thought that was pretty. I like that shade. Um, almost all his shirts are blue, but that's his favorite color and that's where he feels comfortable. So that's where he lands. And it's kind of almost hard to find shirts that aren't don't have a blue background, but anyway, at least this was a different shade of blue and I think it's nice and I like it. And then this is a linen shirt, short sleeve shirt that I think is just really good looking and I think he'll look great in it. So I grabbed that for him too. Um, Olakai flip flops. If you've never tried Olakai, you need to try them. Uh, yes, these flip flops are ones that are very, very good. They have the arch support. They fit the foot so beautifully well, and this is a fabulous price for them. So he's getting a pair of a new pair of Olakai flip flops, and he's also going to get this pair of uh, cap toe derby shoes. Um, it's just another shoe in this color range. I think we give it a try. Decent price to give it a try. See if it fits him and if it works with what we want it to work with. So that's something that's coming to him also. So many things. Um, so many things for the home. So many things. Beauty exclusives. So many items uh, for kids I haven't even touched on, but a lot, a lot of things to be had. But those are, that's pretty much my practical list of the things that I love, own already, or have ordered from the sale. Depending on how much money you spend annually on uh, items at Nordstrom, you're at a different level in their reward system. And this year for the sale, the icons, which is the highest level, they began shopping on Wednesday, July 6th. Ambassadors started on the 7th. Influencers and card holders, just Nordstrom card holders, started shopping on July 9th. So now we are at the 12th at this moment and the anniversary sale opens to the public on the 15th. Now, if you don't have a membership and you don't have any of those levels or whatever, you can sign up for free right now and you automatically lock in influencer status, which means you can get full six days before it opens to the public to shop to your heart's content so you have a much better chance of grabbing items before they're completely sold out. So keep that in mind. Go to Nordstrom. I'll put a link down below where you can find that, where you can sign up for that. So you can just grab things quickly before the 15th. So you need to get on it though, because by the time I get this edited, you know, things will, things are starting to go very quickly, but hopefully you'll get some stuff that you want or take a look at this basics. There's fabulous things in the like lingerie. If you're needing to update your t-shirts, your underwear, you know, all that kind of thing. It's just very, very good time to do something like that when you can get it on sale. So I just wanted to share, show you what I got, show you what I think is worth it. And I will talk to you guys later. Thanks so much. Bye.